John Morant, the number two overall pick in that draft, and suddenly the most exciting player in the NBA, wasn't supposed to land in Memphis until a fortuitous bounce of ping pong balls altered the course the NBA. Here are the reasons how John Morant is making history and changing the NBA. But before we proceed, let us make some shout out, shout out to, JS, thank you for the support. I do random shout out for my subscribers. If you want to get mentioned on my next video, subscribe now. Ja Morant reaches a new peak with a 52-point performance. A leap is supposed to be short-lived defiance of gravity, but nothing feels remotely temporary about the jumps Ja Morant is making. Not his dunks, and certainly not his ascension to superstardom. 48 hours after setting a Grizzlies franchise record with 46 points, Morant bested himself with 52 points and a personal highlight reel in Memphis 118-105 win against the San Antonio Spurs. He needed just 30 shots, 4 three-pointers, for made free throws, and his usual store of hops to do it. The performance punctuated the larger moment Morant is making this season. He has arrived with an eye-grabbing style that rarely goes a game without inspiring social media likes, shares, and did you see that's. His hang time seemed limitless, his potential even more so. Morant's aerial exploits on Monday were borderline Kryptonian, as both big men and buzzers were vanquished in single bounds. Analytically appreciated rim protector Jacob Poltel was reduced to poster material for Morant's latest assault on the rim, a one-handed hammer that featured the extra split second of airtime that only the greats can muster. Despite their youth, the Grizzlies would hardly be welcome opponents to contenders of more established pedigree. Memphis boasts a top-5 offense and a top yen defense, with its entire operation centered around a 22-year-old superstar who figures only to get better with seasoning. Ja Morant is changing the game of basketball. Memphis Grizzlies superstar Ja Morant, like Dirk Nowitzki and Stephen Curry before him, is revolutionizing basketball. And you're watching it happen in real time. There's a new generational talent in the NBA, and he plays for the Memphis Grizzlies. The 2020s are going to be ruled by Ja Morant. Ja Morant is different, from the physical to the trivial. He's popularized the half-up ponytail hairstyle, which was born out of accidental necessity. After Morant put his hair up in December of 2020, we started seeing other stars do the same. Cleveland's Darius Garland and Chicago's Ayo Dosunmu are a couple of names that come to mind. Physically, Morant is comparably sized to Stephen Curry. Morant, 22, is listed at 6'3 and 174 pounds. Curry, 33, is listed at 6'2 and 185 pounds. The fanaticism and electrifying, jaw-dropping abilities at Ja Morant displays on a nightly basis have fully taken over the NBA consciousness. This, despite having just a handful of national TV games this season. Ja Morant is changing what it means to be a great point guard. He excels at so many things, but his signature move goes a little something like this. He dribbles the ball between the half-court line and the three-point line while the offense spreads out. Morant's back pedals slightly, revs up and drives full speed ahead to the paint, and finds a way to shift, dodge, and glide his way to the basket for a high percentage shot. And boy, does he love attacking the basket. Of the 1,013 shots Morant has attempted so far this season, 732 of them have been inside the paint. Three out of every four attempts from Morant has been from inside the paint. He's taken just 60 mid-range shots and 221 shots from beyond the arc, which seems counterintuitive to today's three-point happy style of play. Memphis Grizzlies star Ja Morant possess unparalleled grit and talent. Ja Morant leads the NBA in points in the paint per game, with 16.8 ppg. That's a full point and a half more than the next closest guy, the Greek freak, Giannis Antetokounm, who is roughly 8 inches taller and about 75 pounds heavier. A player so small has never been so dominant and gotten whatever he wants the way Ja has. Morant is setting a new bar, perhaps unachievable for any other future player. He's that special. But, it's the bar nonetheless. Moving forward, players with a similar stature as Morant are no longer going to be expected to just handle the ball, pass well and shoot threes. The next-gen point god possesses the dominance of LeBron James, the handles of Chris Paul, the toughness of Allen Iverson, and the athleticism of Giannis Antetokounmpo. If you were to Frankenstein the perfect NBA player, you would probably come up with something a lot like Morant. He possesses the traits of some of the greatest players to ever play the game. 
And fans are taking notice, evident by having one of the most popular selling jerseys in the NBA for the second consecutive season. Somehow, despite the success and some of the riches that come with it, Ja Morant plays with a massive chip on his shoulder. He is out to prove something every single night. He imposes his will on his opponents until they bend and usually break. Morant is one of the most athletic players in the NBA today, but make no mistake, he's changing the very definition of what it means to be a great point guard in the NBA. Ja Morant is forcing himself and the Grizzlies into lofty conversations. Ja Morant may lead the NBA in TLTO, Timeline Takeovers, this season. In January, he levitated above the rim like Magneto for a two-handed chase-down denial of Avery Bradley that's already being discussed as one of the best blocked shots of all time. In the All-Star game, he had a pair of alley-oop finishes that put this year's dunk contest to shame. In February, he cut through the lane, caught a bounce pass from Steven Adams, and immediately went up and around DeMar DeRozan with an opposite-direction 360 layup. Then, he set the Memphis Grizzlies franchise record for points in a single game with 52, completed a full-court alley-oop buzzer beater that defies description, and dropped a hammer on Jacob Poltel that seemingly changed the big man's name to Seven Footer in headlines. That dazzling performance illustrated a few things simultaneously. Morant is one of the NBA's premier showmen. Whether he intends to be this dynamic or it's a byproduct of his relentless effort, he raises the highlighted potential of every single possession in which he's involved. A turnover can become an all-time great block. Full-court inbounds pass with 0.4 seconds on the clocks and almost no chance of success can turn into two points. And a one-on-three in transition, with no teammates around him to draw attention, can become a dunk of the year candidate. Whether they realize it or not, NBA players compete every season for the unofficial hashtag league pass alert crown. The last definitive wearer was probably Stephen Curry in 2015-16. Since then, he, Giannis Antetokounmpo, Luka Doncic, Nikola Jokic and others have flirted with the honor. In 2021-22, we have another contender. Ja trails only Curry and LeBron James in total views across the NBA's social media platforms this season. Highlights aren't all we get from Morant's performances, though. Gerald Green had his share of jaw-dropping moments, but he averaged 9.7 points for his career and had a below-average true shooting percentage. Morant, meanwhile, is up to 27.6 points, 6.6 assists, 5.9 rebounds, and 1.63s this season. His box plus minus ranks 8th in the league, ahead of Stephen Curry, 6.1, Chris Paul, 5.2, Donovan Mitchell, 5.1, James Harden, 4.6, and Trey Young, 4.6. He's also in the top 10 of Basketball References MVP tracker. Morant's highlights are layered on top of consistent, efficient production. His style may generate much of the attention right now, but the substance lends merit to comparisons to earlier MVP campaigns from the likes of Allen Iverson and Derrick Rose. Morant is right in that range, and at least one of his predecessors is taking note. In case you aren't up on your major American sports trophy trivia, that's Jaws jersey draped over Iverson's MVP trophy. Giving Morant the honor, sooner, might require voters to make a difficult leap. Jokic is having one of the greatest statistical seasons in NBA history. Antetokounmpo isn't far behind. Philadelphia 76ers center Joel Embiid already has plenty of pull in the narrative department. And as absurd as Morant has been, the Grizzlies' point differential is still slightly better when he's off the floor. But it's become increasingly difficult to imagine Ja finishing outside the top 5 in MVP voting this season. It would be silly to bet against him eventually winning the award. Morant has his team positioned for a deep playoff run. And that's the third thing we learned from Monday's performance, a lesson that has been repeatedly reinforced all season. Memphis, which has adopted the audacity with which Morant plays, is a bona fide contender. The Grizzlies have the league's best net rating since November 25th. We aren't dealing with a small sample size now. That's three plus months at the top of the NBA. They also have a 5%, or better, shot to win this year's title in ESPN, Basketball Reference, and 538's projection systems. They aren't the title favorites, but they also aren't write-offs. And however, you want to define him, MVP contender, hashtag league pass alert king, you name it, Morant has proved over the last calendar year that he can be the best player in an individual series. 
He averaged a series-high 30.2 points per game in the Grizzlies' first-round loss to the Utah Jazz last season, outdueling Jazz all-star guard Donovan Mitchell. Doing that in four straight rounds is another story. But for someone who's made the impossible happen on plenty of individual plays, that isn't out of reach, either. These were the reasons how Ja Morant is making history and changing the NBA. Comment below your opinion about this amazing player. Like the video and subscribe, see you at my next video.